Alrighty, my people, welcome to the Score Channel. Welcome to another night of gaming with The Sims. We're going to see if we can get it to work this time uh, with the whole going to college thing because it hasn't been going very well. Uh, as you can see, I've moved back in with the Score family because I am apparently unable to pass a class to save my life. It's, it's actually getting kind of to the point where I'm a little worried about myself. Like, how is it possible that I cannot get these things done? I mean... I did all the work. I did the term papers. I even did like multiple revisions of the term papers. I did my freaking homework. I even like emailed my professors in the last term and I got straight F's every single course an F and it's like a big F you to me. I, I feel like I did a better job than that. I don't feel like I deserve that, but that's what happened. So we're going to figure it out. I'm able to register for courses again today. So as soon as my homeboy here wakes up, we're going to try it again and we're going to see if we can get back into this and make it work. I, I believe I, I'm not going to give up yet on my dream of graduating in villainy and being like awesome. You know, that's the plan. Um, in other news, it seems like uh, Gustavo is um, going to die soon based on what the game was telling me. It also seems like apparently we need to buy a trash can uh, for the outside. So yeah, let's do that because apparently we didn't do that. Um, Look at the dope music that that makes. All right, because apparently we haven't been able to take out the trash, and that's becoming a problem. Um, so, yeah, basically, I am trying to get back into college, become a successful human being again. We'll see if I can make it work. I, I have my doubts, I'll be honest. I, at this point, I'm beginning to wonder if, like, the game is just broken or what. Like, I don't understand how, <laughs> how I can do it any better. I'm like... I'm at a loss because I, I had high scores in the different skills, had like, yeah, see, look right here. Gustavo scores long life is coming to an end. This would be a good time to get his affairs in order. Jesus, man, this got intense very quickly. I was about to, about to kick the bucket here. And, and I got to be honest, I'm not ready for that. I'm not like emotionally ready for that, you know? Um, so, so yeah, we're going to, we're going to try to restore my, my confidence in myself here. We're going to take a, Take a thoughtful shower. Get ready for trying to apply to college again. I'm sorry I've been such a disappointment to you, old Tavo. Um, you know, it's, it wasn't my intention. It's it's disappointing to be honest that this is this is what I got. But um, but yeah, I, I'm somehow still extremely fat compared to before when I started this process. Uh, so it's been nothing but basically a failure on on every front. Um, <laughs> so. I don't know why college is so hard in this game. Why are you coming in here while I'm showering, Billy? Yeah, that's weird. Don't be doing that. Come on, don't you hear the shower running in there? Jesus Christ, people. You know? So, I believe we can make it back. I think we can make it back. I don't know. Maybe there's something that I still need to figure out in this process. Maybe there's something I need to do that I'm not doing. I don't know yet. I, I'm not sure what the solution is exactly. But I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to do my best to, like you know, do a better job this time around. So we're going to get, we're going to come out of this shower. We're going to get breakfast. Jesus, everything in this house is breaking, you know, you'll just deal with that later. All right. Don't worry about it. Um, do whatever you want. You guys, you guys just do your thing. Um, yeah. Talo apparently ate some bad fruitcake. That's kind of funny. Does anyone fruitcake? It's funny how fruitcake is such a like thing. What's up, Rolo? I see you. Um, how you doing, brother? Thanks for hanging out. Uh, yeah, fruitcake. I, I got some fruitcake takes for you today. Um, listen, fruitcake, first of all, is something that is much more common in Peru. I didn't realize it was such a big deal in this country. Um, but when I first moved here, you know, Christmas time came around and everybody was ordering their panetón. And that's fruitcake, right? That's basically what it is, fruitcake. And see... In the United States, fruitcake is kind of a joke, okay? It's it's not exactly something that we take seriously. I don't know how to explain it to you. It's like, it's just a thing that we sort of make fun of. I mean, even Kirby, one of his many forms in his down B attack is a fruitcake because it's like a big, heavy fruitcake that lands on people. That's a real thing. And, and so there's a part of me that kind of wonders why fruitcake is so popular here. I don't fully understand it, to be honest. It's, it's kind of strange. Um, because for me, it's, it's like something that we sort of ridicule, make fun of, but you know, whatever. It's not like there's anything wrong with fruitcake. I've had some very good fruitcakes in my day. Um, but it is just something that like here you don't get 
Like, I don't know, it's a big deal here. You gotta have your pentatonin at Christmas time. Everybody takes that very seriously. Aw, oh, man. Yeah, well, I'm fixing your toilet. Do you want it fixed or not? I know how to fix things, just like in real life. So, you can, you can have your choice, brother. Either I can clean up your bathroom and fix your toilet, or we can all be miserable. Uh, throw that stuff away. I don't know what that is. Yeah. Taking care of business. Look at me being responsible. All right. University. Let's go for it again, okay? We're going to apply to universities. Oh, wait. No, there was a re-enroll option. Okay. So let's do that instead. Re-enroll. I am inspired. I'm ready. I'm going to go back to college. Yeah, Chocotone better than Panatone. You know what? Um, I'm not I'm, I'm, I'm. not sure about that. I, I've had some really good ones. I like them when they're warm. You know, you put them in the oven, they get nice and toasty. Um, but... You know. All right. So let's try this again. We're going to do, you know, one of, we're going to do what we did before. All right. So, um, what was the other one that I took that, uh, what was the other, oh, video game. Yeah. Let's do the video game history class. I'm not bad at those. All right. So I need to complete eight classes. I didn't complete any on the last term. We got to try this again. I believe we can make it. Let's go for it. We're going to, all right. I could stay at home and not spend money on campus, but I want to get back to where I was. I want to go back. I miss all my friends. And also this one's pretty cheap. So, all right, we're going to pay that with this, with the money we got in the bank. And we're going to transfer. What? Wait, what? Split from household and move. Um, Oh yeah, let's move. Let's move like we 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 were running out of money before. That was a problem. Now we got some more money. Let's move that money over so my man has some money. Looks like I'm back in college. Tokarczyk. I don't know Lupa Wasa. I don't know what that is. I don't is that Tokarczyk? Is that like somebody is that my replacement? Is that who you're talking about? It's okay. I, I'm not gonna pretend like I was like the best history teacher in the world if that's who my replacement is. Good for them, you know. I hope they're doing well. Um Alright, we're back in college, people. Let's see if we can make it work today. All right, so let's let's evaluate the situation. So we haven't started the term yet. We've got a Monday, Wednesday, Friday course. And we've got double on Tuesday, Thursday with term papers. We're going to be responsible students this time. It's like I never left. You know, look, there's even the drink that I left on the table from before. Perfect. That's what you love to see. You know, we're going to make it work. Um so let's do, let's do some term paper. Let's, let's, let's write some term paper for Blick Block video game history. Uh, we, we're going to start being responsible. Oh, get off the computer, you fool. You're on my computer. I was just going to do that. All right. Well, fine. Fine. Okay. You know what? We'll, uh, we'll just do some homework. We'll just do some homework for class. All right. Actually, never mind. You know what? Somebody got off the computer. I can sit down and do it. I, I'm going to make this term better. I'm going to do it again. All right. It's awkward. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Thanks. Lupo. Um, you know what? It, it's all good though. Like I said, if, if you guys like the new dude, I'm, I'm happy for you. Actually, I would hope that it would be my dream personally that you guys be like, Oh, the new teacher is awesome. And then we're happy with that. that. That would make me happy, you know, for you guys, obviously. Um, cause you know, I know, I know it ain't easy changing things up. People do things differently. Sometimes you like things that other people do. Sometimes you don't. That's how it goes. I had, I had a teacher change when I was in high school that really messed me up. It was funny. Um, I had this, it was Spanish class of all classes. Uh, the first teacher I had, she was really cool and we got along really well and like everything was good. You know, we had a good time. And like, I think that she was in large part, one of the reasons why I ended up coming to Peru. Cause she was like such a good teacher in Spanish. And I remember liking it so much that I thought like, yeah, you know what? I could, uh, I could do this. I could like, you know, I could uh, go to a country and speak Spanish or something. I, I couldn't. I didn't have any Spanish skills because of that class. I, it was very basic what I learned, but it was still motivating, you know? Like, I enjoyed the class. I felt like I was learning something. And then, next year, I got a new teacher, completely different teacher. This guy was way tougher, way stricter, you know? Um, I have no opinion on that, Mr. Rolo. I, I, got, I got no... I'm not going to go there. I don't have feelings about it. You know, I got, I got my own thoughts and feelings about a lot of things, but I don't prefer to talk about other people that much, honestly. Um, it's not my business, you know? And also I've only known these people virtually for a short time. I really don't have enough 
like of an opinion form you know what i mean um so yeah like <laughs> what i was saying like his new teacher he just wrecked me man i like he wrecked me every single way and i don't know why i don't know what it was but like he just gave me the worst grades in the class I, he was way stricter on things like the tildes and stuff on the Spanish and like I hadn't learned those because the previous teacher was a little more relaxed about that. She was just more like, hey, if you're using the right words and the right grammar, that's good for now. This guy was like, I expect you to have perfect, you know, or orthographia and everything. And I was like, man, I don't know how to do all this crap. So I, I, I really struggled with that class that year. And then I was like failing the class because the guy said there was a like international day at the school <laughs> um Lupo. well roller you're here more dude you're here more so i respect i mean that you know you you show your support i appreciate so yeah that, that gives you some points um <laughs> so yeah like it was funny i ended up like having a fight with this teacher because he wanted me to wear a shirt from another country and I didn't have a shirt from another country. And he was like, make one. And I was like, bro, do you realize how dumb I'm going to look if I come to school with a shirt that I made myself with like another country on it? Like, I'm going to get made fun of for the rest of my life. It's not worth it. And he was like, well, then fine. I guess passing my class isn't worth it. And I was like, yeah, it's not. <laughs> You're literally going to grade me on whether I wear a shirt or not. Like, that has nothing to do with Spanish. I'm sorry. And in the end, I just ended up, like, getting, I think, a D minus in that course. Like, I got just above passing. He ended up passing me because I think he knew that if I pushed the issue, it was going to be a problem. Uh, I didn't have a Peru shirt back then. I had, so I had no shirts from any other countries because this is America. And we don't know about other countries. And I guess that's why he wanted us to do it. And funny enough, after that event... Like two days later, I went to a store and I saw a shirt that was like about Brazil and I thought it was cool. So I bought it. So I had a freaking Brazil shirt like the next day, uh, <laughs> but not when I needed it. So that was the whole thing. So, yeah, sometimes that happens with, with uh, school, you know, you don't always get like fair treatment. With things, I think. But that's how it goes. Um, so, you know, we got a term paper done. Already got a draft of a term paper anyway. Um, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm trying, I'm gonna try really hard to get them good grades and be ready to go. Uh, let's work on that homework for unsecuring secure locations. Let's be super, super productive and responsible. I believe I can do it. I, I want to. All right, I'm gonna. Where am I? Where's my dude? Okay, he's in here sitting on his bed, studying and being smart. Look, here's another random person who just came over. Ishan, Gandhi. What's up, Gandhi? How you doing, bro? This is an interesting looking Gandhi. This guy's got a cool mustache. You know, he's doing his thing. So yeah. Yeah, those are some of the... Oh, and then the other semester I had Spanish. I still did one more semester because it was the, the second half of the year. That semester I didn't learn anything because we had this like very, very, very nice uh, teacher from Colombia. She was an exchange student and she came... She was like 24, I think, or something like that. She was doing like practice for her career to become a teacher. And she was teaching Spanish, but I wasn't learning anything. I can say that much. Um, that was funny. That, that time, that was pretty entertaining. All right, is there any magic food laying around here? No, there's that. Yeah, let's do that. Um, who is this character? All right. All right, you got to eat. Do your homework and eat. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Get to food, get to food, get to food, get to food, get to food. Still fresh, still fresh. Lobster thermometer. Again, I don't know who's making random lobster. Uh, so my Spanish grade, so like those first years in middle school when I took Spanish, I was getting like A's, B's. I was doing really good. I, I was I was clicking. And then when I switched to that new guy and that Colombian chick, I, I was almost failing the course. Like I, I literally was this close to being like repeating that class and yeah <laughs> just didn't go well at all um oh which bed's mine now i don't even know anymore because i haven't been here in so long i guess it's this one seems like it because everybody else is sleeping in different beds and must be mine so yeah yeah i was pretty much failing spanish ironically enough and now here i am speaking spanish in peru which is kind of funny. I actually emailed that first teacher years later um, 
to say, hey, thanks. Cause like, I appreciate what she did. Cause like, she would tell me all about her stories of like working and studying in Argentina. And that stuff kind of was like in my brain when I decided to come to Peru. And sure enough, that was like motivating for me. And uh, she was like, she actually responded. She's still working at the same school. And she wrote back to me and was like, oh, that's so cool. I remember you, blah, blah, blah. And that was kind of a cool moment. Because, you know, you don't really think, like, anyone's going to really remember you, <laughs> like, care. Um, so, yeah, that was a thing that happened. All right. Um, okay, we're going to do Banyo. Sleep on the floor. Yeah, sleeping on the floor is an option, I suppose. I mean, I've done it. Um, bro, go. Let's go. What are you waiting for? What? Why is he doing it out of order? I don't know. He's weird. All right. Hide from everyone. Now my man's embarrassed from like showering around other people. That wasn't the case before, dude. You didn't used to care about these things when you were in college the first time. Why have you suddenly become so, you know, worried about these things? Oh, term days left not yet started? Seriously? Like we haven't started classes yet or what? Like, so let's see. Will it send me to class this morning? Like it should. Okay, I guess not. I guess we're not ready to start the term. So that means I can be extra responsible and do like more things. That's that's smart. I like it. Let's do that. Let's uh clean up around here a little bit. Doors for the toilet but not for the shower. That is a good question. I got to wonder what was going on with the like decision making process in this place. It's a little weird. I'm not going to lie. It's a little strange to me. Um I don't get it either, honestly. Because, like, you would think, right, if you have doors on one, you'd have doors on the other. But I guess not. So, who knows? Um, okay, let's do... Let's do the other term paper. Let's work on that, too. What's going on with the phone? Um, not right now. We're good. We're, we're going to be okay. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm... Like, I know there's some dorms that have open showers and stuff, but, like, when it's all guys, definitely not co-ed. And, like, I don't know how many still do that. I feel like that's not very common these days. I, I would be surprised. Uh, I'm studying villainy. I'm trying to get a degree in villainy to become a villain because I feel like that, of all the careers, was the one I most identified with, you know? It's about creating mischief and doing crazy things and stuff. I like that I got my fitness skill up by just sitting here typing on a computer. That's pretty cool. Um, that's fitness right there. So, yeah. that's I'm trying to get this degree in villainy so I can be a master of mischief and crazy activities. And that's something that, you know, I want to do in real life is, is kind of do that stuff. But, um, you know, it hasn't been easy. Apparently, it's very difficult to become a villain in this game. you got to, like, really study hard because... As much as I did all the work last time, I still failed on my freaking classes, and I don't understand. Like, as I've been trying to figure that out. Like, what do I need to do differently? But I can't. Um, she wants to join the, the good timers. Yeah, you should. You should join the good timers. We're good timers. All right, let's go. Let's get free food. Free food over here, baby. Free food's where it's at. Why is that a thing? I don't know why it's a thing. I think it's just because the game wants to have some fun. Um... I mean, it's The Sims, you know, so it's always going to be a little bit silly about some things. Oh, I saw a funny thing related to The Sims today. Um, so apparently, like, in Russia, you know, they're trying to make Ukraine look bad. And they, like, took a picture of this guy's, like, Nazi stuff. It was supposed to be like, oh, look, this is proof that this person is, like, doing Nazi things. And what's funny about it is, like... One of the things that was supposed to be there was like SIM cards, you know, it said apparently like the guy's list said three SIMs. And so <laughs> what should have been three SIM cards is actually <laughs> like three copies of the Sims three. Like the guy has copies of the Sims three and he's arguing that that makes like a Nazi. So this is just how messed up Russia is right now. They're just like completely confused as to what things are. It's... All right, um, I wanna eat. Why can't I eat? Why can I only get water? Oh, 
What the heck? Why can't we just uh, get a little like food here? Why? Why can't I? Oh, there we go. Apparently, I just need to say hi first. Oh, steak! Free steak! Let's go. Free steak is good steak. Thanks. Thanks for the free steak. Let's go. Let's eat that steak. Yeah. Thanks. Thanks for food. Cool. I want to eat. Stop talking to people and eat. Yeah. Man gets hungry all the time. Um, that's all right. Thanks though for the opportunity to join the Humor and Hijinks Festival, but you know, I'm trying to take care of business here. Yeah. Cool. I'm meeting people, having a good time. Somehow I'm all of a sudden uncomfortable. I'm scratchy. <laughs> Over the illness. I don't know why. I'm s My guys got like the itch. Uh. But now it's gone. All right, good. Okay. So. Stop eating. Who cares? Yeah, go out here and play chess with this person. You know? That'd be fun. Or not. You know, just play by yourself. That's fine, too. Who cares? It's, it's not like you're going to be forever alone and depressed because you can't pass a single course in college and you're just sitting here playing chess on your own. He's very focused, though. I like it. All right. His bar is boosting up when you're focused. Getting him bonus points. All right, good. Okay. Let's go back to... Let's see. Um, study for... Securing secure location. Yeah. All right. Classes start in... Okay, so we have classes starting tomorrow. Cool. All right, good stuff. I like it. All right. So, study for some stuff. Yeah. We're going to study for some some courses here. We're going to get good. We're going to be smart, and we're going to learn things, and we're going to do better this time, I believe. Let's see what the internet looks like on this old computer. All right. Oh, yeah. All right, cool. Internet. Good stuff. This is, uh, yeah, we're reading stuff on the internet. Look at this computer. Such an old-looking computer. I swear they really haven't updated. This thing has a five-and-a-quarter floppy drive, like... Y'all don't even know probably what a regular floppy drive is. But this has a five and a quarter. That is a five and a quarter drive right there. And I don't know who on earth is still using a computer with a five and a quarter floppy drive. But apparently some people are. Apparently some of them are playing The Sims 4. And The Sims 4 definitely was not out when the five and a quarter floppy drive was a thing. So I don't have, I don't have a good answer as to why that is. But hey, let's change it up. Let's study another course. Let's study a little more. Study a little bit of everything. All right. I'm going to be better than a D plus student. I believe. I have faith in my abilities. All right. I'm staying up late studying here. I'm doing a good job. All right. Tomorrow we got class 11, 8 a.m. All right. We need to, we need to get out of here. Yeah. Time to go home. We got to start getting our sleepy. That's some like intense Batman music, you know? I like it. Alright. Um, okay. Let's do. Let's see. Let's take a look around here. Is there anything I should do before I call it a night? My man wants to do his homework. Alright, let's do your homework, bro. Do your homework a little bit. I like this plan. He's focused. He wants to do his homework. He wants to knock it out. I'm okay with that. You know, we are going to have to get some sleep, but I like the fact that he's doing it while he's like concentrated. He's got his mojo. He's vibing, feeling good, solid. Okay. So it's about to fade away. That's fine. I like it. That's okay. Let's, uh, let's put away the homework. All right. And then pee like a champion. Yes. That's what I want to do. I want to pee like a champion. How do you pee like a champion? What does that look like? Do a little one of these. Like, I, I don't know if you ever do the hands on your hips, pee, but, you know, it is pretty uh, pretty satisfying when you do be like a champion. I try to do that from time to time. I think it's good for you. All right. Going to bed. I don't know if that's your bed or not. It's mine now. We got to get up for class. Hopefully somebody makes magic food appear in the morning so that I have some food in my belly for learning and, you know, being smarter. Look at all these people, these tryhards, staying up till, like, Two in the morning to study. What are these people? All right. 
Let's see. Three, four, five. I think this might be about a good time to get up, start doing things and stuff. Let's see. We got class at, yeah, in three hours. And I've only done part of that homework. But you know what? It's okay. Right? Is it? <clears throat> Did I prioritize this poorly? Have I made a fatal mistake? I don't think so. All right. Um, let's see here. I kind of want to just keep sleeping so my hunger bar doesn't deplete. Unless somebody magically comes up with food. Like, I want to be kind of well rested and ready to go. Um, hmm. I could get to class early though if I'm responsible, so that would be good too. Let's uh, let's do let's do quick shower, brisk shower. Let's go fast. You know, we'll be like ready to go. Get, get in the mood. Get in the zone. Got to start the day. All right. Cool. All right. I believe. I think we're looking pretty good here. I think we're looking pretty good. We are pretty hungry, but that's okay. We'll take care of that business in a bit. Um, yeah, go to class early. I like it. I like it. My man's going to be responsible. I think it's a good plan. All right. So let's do it. Let's go to class. Hopefully have a nice start to the day. I mean... This is the elective, right? So the elective shouldn't be too bad. Shouldn't be too too demanding. Then again, again, this is like me having failed the previous courses. Maybe I'm over simplifying things here. Maybe I'm being overconfident. I don't know, but we'll find out. So let's see. All right, we're gonna finish this class at 925. And then let's go. All right. Go to the commons. Let's get some breakfast. We're hungry. And then we'll go back to class. Be in good shape. I think it's a good plan for today. Let's see if I can pull this off. If I can get back into college and actually do it right. I'm very disappointed in how things went last time. Look at all these books just laying on the floor. All right. Whoever's job it is to open up the food. Open up the food. Get over here. I don't know why you're not here when I get here. Like, every time I come here, I have to, like, wait for you to give me food. All right, which is lame. Oh, wow. Okay, my guys. How am I not hungry? I was starving before I went to class. And now... All right, I'm just going to class with an omelet. Sweet. I like this plan. Let's do it. Let's just go to class with an omelet in my hand. I'm sure that won't negatively affect me in any way. Let's see. All right. Am I going to class? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see what happens. I should be in class right now. Um, in two minutes. Go, go to class, go to class. All right, okay. <laughs> All right, so have, I've been working on the term papers. That's good. I didn't do all my homework. That's tough. It's tough to do all your homework every freaking day. I don't understand how they expect me to do all that. Um, I don't know how much that impacts the grade, though. Like, I did some homework the previous time. And I did, I think, get a pretty good result from doing that. Let's get over here. Let's have some fun. Let's uh, let's get some work done. We'll be responsible in this area. Yeah. Play some chess. Yeah. Go be go be smart. Cause being smart, you know, makes you feel better about yourself. A little bit of, little bit of chess playing time boosts that funometer. Cause you need it. It's good for you. And that's probably enough. All right, let's do let's do some homework. Homework for the Blick Brock game. Okay, because we haven't done it yet. Let's go sit down and do your homework. Yep, be responsible. Hey, what's up, friend? Kafus. What's up, Kafus? How you doing, bro? He's like, yo, bro, let me talk to you about cars while you... Hey, what's up? Let me talk to this guy about this guy while we're sitting here. Yeah, we're doing homework and talking about things. We're definitely making learning happen. Yeah, let's just all hang out and talk to me while I'm trying to do my homework. Can't see any problems with that. Oh, I'm getting all depressed and emo now. 
on I'm Fortnite. Hey, what's up, Alexander Goth? How you doing? You're going to college? I know your dad, Mortimer. He's an old school OG character. I've heard of him before. Yeah. Getting on them social points while I try to do my homework. Kephas, how you doing? What's up, guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Funny introduction. Yeah, let me introduce myself to you guys now that I've sat here and talked to you for a few minutes. And then, uh, you know, just continue to do my homework like a responsible lad. So tomorrow we just have the one class, which we've already prepared for in terms of, like, doing homework. So that's good. That should be a solid point in our favor. Maybe we'll do a little study time, see how that goes. And then we can go get some free food here. Dinner opens at 5. That's perfect timing for me. Okay. Are you done with your homework? Are you done with your homework? Are you done with your homework? Yeah. Okay. You're done with your homework. Let's go here. Let's, let's go to... Let's get some food. Um, let me have food. I don't just want water. You said it was open at five. Listen, person, why do I have to why do I have to keep introducing myself to whoever makes the food? Alright, would you please would you please serve food? Serve the food. Serve the food. Serve the food. Do your job. Thank you. Do your job. Give me fish tacos. Let's go. I don't understand who you think you are standing around here. You're probably getting paid by the campus to sit around and do nothing. Meanwhile, I'm sitting here trying to get fish tacos. It's like, people, please. Basic. Yeah, but look at me being all social and having a good time talking to people and getting fatter. Gotta love it. I swear, I don't know what I'm doing to make my dude so chunky. Like, I am trying really, really hard, but there's just nothing I can seem to do here. All right, where's my man at? Where'd he go? Are you still standing here talking to her? Just pounding those fish tacos? You're like, hey, what's up? Yeah, let's talk while I eat fish tacos in front of your face. There's like my food from this morning that I left. <laughs> Get on the mic and start telling some uh, stand-up. Yeah, you know? Now I'm a fat comedian. Yeah. When you speed it up three times, it's pretty funny. Anyway. Like, just, yeah, everybody's loving my jokes. Hey, sweet. Cool. Um, all right. Yeah, this guy likes it. He's he's enjoying it. Thanks, bro. Let's do Beverly. Appreciate your fan support. You know, you can go to my Patreon or whatever. All right, cool. Yeah, good stuff. Gotta love it. All right, let's study for... Let's see. All right. So, I think it would be wise... We've done homework for this. We haven't done homework for that, which we can do by Thursday. This homework is done. Let's study for... Make no, it's, you know what? We're not going to be social, money. Yeah, they would stop trying to get me to go over there and do stuff that's fun. Okay, we're in college now, and we already failed a whole semester, so we're going to be super, super responsible and see where that gets us. We'll see if that works. I, I don't know if it will. Honestly, I don't I don't actually know. But I'm going to try. I'm going to try to be responsible. All right. I think that's enough. I think we can go back to the pad. Time to time to continue on day two. Let's make it happen. We could uh, we could watch a little TV, just a little bit of TV. We need to get a little bit of fun points in here before we call it a night, because uh, tomorrow's class's schedule is pretty nice. We only have one, so we can we can get a little bit of fun points. And it's a late start tomorrow, so that's good. Let's get our levels up. Um, you need to stop eating all the time. You are always eating, dude. It is kind of getting ridiculous, like. You really shouldn't be doing that. Just constantly putting food in his face, this guy. All right. 
So, there we go. Let's get our sleep on. So, we've got... we got to keep working on the term papers. And there's six days left in the term, so... Next week it'll finish up. All right, pretty reasonable. I think we're doing okay. I think we'll. I think we'll be all right. I think we're gonna make it through. Um, hope you know. I just. I really want to see my guy get through the end of this. Like I don't want to just be the college dropout that Kanye West was. You know. I want to go beyond that. I want to do better than easy. Uh, so that's the goal. But you know, it's not looking great to be honest right now. All right. Let's call it a night there let's uh scavenge for parts and then throw away let's let's get in here and because i'm good at repairing stuff i can always re you know take some parts and clean up some things let's let's be responsible around here clean up a little bit see if there's any um good food to eat yeah eat that pasta primavera for breakfast that sounds good after cleaning up that other crap i like this plan I think this is a good idea. Yes, give me some food. Oh, the food got funky as soon as I went to eat it. On Fortnite. All right, well, that's okay. Just use the pot. All right, let's go to the bathroom. And then we'll get cleaned up. Oh. Yeah, we'll go to the other one. We'll go to the other one. Let's go. Let's go. Get cleaned up. Let's do it. Okay, fresh pasta. All right, cool. We can grab a serving of that before class starts. That sounds like a good plan. Get some food in your belly and be ready to go. And then you got you got your homework done and you've studied a little bit for this class, so you should in, you should be in good shape, my man. Let's see. I'm inspired. I'm feeling pretty good. What's up? You got cool blue hair in your hair, Meredith Owens. All these people are different. It's none of the same people. Look what happens when you miss a single semester. You you fail your courses, and now all your friends are gone. All the cool people that you thought you were going to hang out with forever and ever, gone. All right, that's what happens when you fail your courses. That's why you don't want to fail your courses. You want to be responsible. I, You know, I had some close calls in real life. I, You know, when I was doing um, university and whatnot, it was like that. I had a couple moments where it was close. I almost failed some courses. And like, that was my main motivation for not wanting to fail was knowing that like, if I fail this course, what is wrong with this person? She got like stank coming off of her. Um, if you failed them courses, then you're not gonna hang out with those people anymore. You're not gonna be, you know, like, you're not gonna be able to go. Yeah, she's kind of cool. Maybe we should hang out with her some more. Yeah, you're just gonna miss out on all those friends and stuff and that's lame. All right, dude, go to class. <laughs> We're talking to this chick. All right, I understand why you're talking to her, but no, we gotta be responsible. All right, we're gonna be responsible people. Okay. So, let's see. Homework. Next one would be to do make the escape homework. We should do that before we go to that class. That's a good idea. Let's, uh, let's get out of this. Okay. Seems pretty good to me. All right. Okay, good. See, he turned in his homework confidently, squeezed every bit of knowledge that he could. I like this. Okay? I think that's a good sign. That's a good sign. I like it. I like what I see. Now, I got more fresh homework to do. We're going to have to get her done. I'm going to sit out here. There's a random... Uh, oh, I, man, this guy. How did this guy get into college? He's an interesting looking dude. Yeah. All right, cool. Be responsible and do our homework while we're talking to this crazy looking guy. Yeah. Crazy. I mean, I shouldn't judge his gray hair, but it is a little weird that this guy like kind of looks like he... Sells certain things on the street, you know, Nehemiah. I don't know. A little bit weird. A little bit sus, this guy. I'm not sure I trust him. These guys look like they're, you know, they're trying to be bad influences on me. Like they want me to do something that I shouldn't do. It would be irresponsible. You know, I'm not sure I trust. Right. Let's see. Did I do my homework? Do my homework? It always makes you wait a little bit. Yeah, sure. Sure, come on over and hang out, Marielle. We can hang out and have fun. 
Alright. Now, let's go back home. You need to go, you need to use the bathroom urgently. And you're pretty hungry. Yeah, so uh, let's grab a, grab a piece of that pasta. Yeah, good plan. All right, and then let's take a look here. So we got the homework done for that. We got to keep working on this term paper. And we got to do, all right, you should, uh, you should say hi, you know, to this person. She's been following you around for a while. It's like, she seems like she's into you. So maybe, you know, just have a little chat. Say what's up. Dang, K, K, what's his name? Kfis, Kfis is a beast. Look at this unit. Jeez, he's like a Samoan monster. It's huge. Cool. All right. Good stuff. Um, Ariely's just here hanging out. Let's uh, let's get your dance on. You know, I think you could use some dancing time. And uh, yeah. Yeah, Maria to get her dance on with us. Yeah, let's dance. Let's party. Boom. That's how we do. Ugh. My man's a little tense. He's a, he's a little stressed. He's working really hard. You know, he's trying trying to get them good grades this time around. He's had a rough time of it. Last few semesters have not been kind to my man. So we're trying our hardest, you know, to do better. Hopefully, hopefully we can do a little better. Let's see. We're just gossiping. We're just chatting. She's leaving. She's out. Okay, cool. Thanks for hanging out. Fun times. Oh, that sounded a little laggy, a little weird. I'm going to save it. I got trust. I do not have big trust here. All right. So, we've got homework complete for these two things. We need to work on that term paper. Got to work on the term paper. All right. Blick Block's already done. We got to work on the Make the Escape paper. We got to at least get one revision in here, I think. That's how I feel. All right, um, this chick is everywhere I want to be. It's getting weird. Hey, do you mind just getting out of the way so I can use that? Thanks. Cool. Awesome. Good stuff. I'm, I'm too poor to have my own, like, tablet, so. Okay, cool. That, that term paper is done. Excellent. That's good stuff. I can submit those term papers, and that should be okay. That's something. Anyway. Um, all right, he wants to sit and hang and watch TV. I feel like we could be doing something else that's more productive. Um, let's see. Tomorrow we got our double day early in the morning. Let's do homework for this one. Let's be responsible. All right. We're doing pretty good. All our bars are up high. We're looking good. Let's get some homework done and hang out with people. Look at us all being responsible students. Everybody's talking and studying. And there's still this New Year's Eve drink that's just sitting there. It's been sitting there since... Oh, dang. This girl's stanky. Look at that. She got stank. You got, like, green coming off of her. That's nasty, yo. Shower, people. All right? You need to clean yourself up regularly. What does this do? Oh, oh this is a roommate's friend, Brian Escobedo. He's elder. Just some old random dude in, like, a smoking jacket that shows up and hangs out with a bunch of young people at the university. Nothing weird about that at all. Definitely. All right. Feeling pretty good here. Feeling like, all right. Homework for this class is almost done. We don't have class for a while. We can put that away. All right. Let's put that away. Let's drink this drink this mysterious thing that's been sitting here for days on end. Yeah. All right. Now go to bed. Okay. I think we're I think we're in good shape. I think we're gonna be okay. So tomorrow is double day. We've got, yeah, we've done good. I mean, we're, we're, we're gonna get through this term, I believe it. I think we're gonna make it, I hope. We'll find out next week, I think. I don't know that I'll make it all the way through this term today. But I'm gonna try, that's the goal. All right, um, okay. So, probably a good time to get up. Yeah. All the food is stanky. All the food is stanky. That's fine. Again, I don't seem to need to eat in the mornings. Like, 
It'll just give me magic food points as soon as I go to class, so... I don't see any real reason to, like, you know, eat a bunch of food in the morning. I mean, if it's there, great. What's up? Um, but, you know, not really necessary. Alright. So, let's go to class. Let's be responsible. Good stuff. He's fine. That's all we need. Fine as most of the days. Alright, so... Knocking out our Blick Block video game history class first thing in the morning. Getting there early. Being responsible. Look at me go. Look, there's just a random a guitar hanging out here. That's that's interesting. Okay, this class is over here. Okay. Go to class. Let's do it. And then if we can get this knocked out with the homework and everything, then... We can finish the homework here for unsecuring secure locations. Although we still got to go to this one and make the escape right after. So what we should do is as soon as we finish this class, let's see. Work on the homework. Yep. Uh-huh. I think this is good. I like how we're figuring this out. I feel like I got to use my time more effectively. If there's something that I was doing wrong, it was probably that. Like, I wasn't using my time very effectively. Here I got this dead hour between two classes. And I'm not using it for anything except now I'm using it to do my homework and I'm being responsible. That's how it's supposed to work. All right. That's what I wasn't doing before. I think that was that was my problem. I wasn't finding ways to use my time intelligently. All right. See, look at that. I got that homework done before it was time to go to my next class. Go to class. Go to class. You got to run all the way over here. Good stuff. Go to class. All right. Yes. Excellent. Okay. So now I just got to work on those term papers. And again, you know, I mean, there's going to be new homework as soon as we get through the old homework, but that's fine. That's okay. Maybe I need to just do all my homework. You know, I'm not even like applying my own advice in life because I've always said with university, like secret to success at university is do all your freaking homework, man. If you do all your freaking homework, I guarantee you're going to have better results. I That was how I passed most of my classes, was just doing all my homework. And that's something I haven't truly done in this game. Maybe that's part of the problem. Maybe I'm not doing all my homework, and maybe that's why. I'm trying to find the variables. Like, what are the variables that are keeping me from, you know, getting the results that I'm trying to get here? So now we've got, okay. We got two homework things that we haven't done yet, but we got the whole weekend to work on. So that's good. We've got a final exam here that we got to, you know, practice on. So we can study on the computer for that a little bit. Um, I can do drafts of these term papers as well. That's important as well. I need to probably do some stuff with that. All right. So let's, let's do this. Let's work on the homework. And let's do let's do the homework together. Let's do homework with other people. Let's be like extra responsible. Hello, Judah Beverly. Yeah, you were the guy that thought my jokes were funny. I'm just standing in the room doing homework in the bathroom with everybody. Don't mind me, guys. You guys want to do homework together in the bathroom? I mean, it's totally normal. Everybody gets, you know, sometimes you're in the bathroom and someone offers you some homework and you just do the homework with them. It's not a big deal. It's not like there's anything wrong with doing homework in the bathroom. I mean, you know, I wouldn't necessarily recommend it. It it's depends on how comfortable you are with other people and doing homework. I'm essentially just taking over this bathroom and being like, nah, this is my bathroom now. So, all right, let's, um, okay, he wants to sit here. All right, sit here and enjoy. My man, propose a crazy scheme. He's, he's always got some crazy ideas. Alright, so, yeah, we knock out the homework, we'll grab some free food. And we'll have some fun. I think this is a good plan. My man needs fun. He's dying of no fun. He's like, please, please, let me have some fun. Okay. You know what? Tell jokes. Go ahead. You're good on homework. Okay. 
Knox. Wish. Jokes. Kind of jokes are funny. Uber People like when you tell jokes. Uber you enjoy your telling jokes. Go ahead and tell jokes. Make everybody crack up and laugh and have a good time. Judah loves you. He thinks you're really funny. Maybe I can tell a joke where I also enjoy Um, hey, sorry, my dear. I don't want to hang out tonight. I gotta be responsible. Always want to hang out. Always trying to have a good time, which I appreciate. I do. Let's go. Okay. That's enough fun. And then go get food. Get that uh, grilled chicken. Grilled chicken sounds good. Yeah. There you go. Give me that free food. Thank you. Oh. Time to eat. Say hi to this person. Like you. You know, that's one of the people activities. Hey, what's up? Yeah, say hi. Nice job. Okay. So we got two homeworks down. So that's okay that we got a little time for that. The whole weekend ahead of us to knock that out. Um, unsecuring secure locations. Excuse the plushie. See, so that's the only thing that's lame is I can't do, like, some of the activities that I want to do here. Like, I can't do... <laughs> it's a crazy scheme. Can I, can I propose a crazy scheme? Uh, it doesn't seem like I can. For some reason, maybe I just don't know this person enough to propose a crazy scheme. You know, I noticed that there's this bit about asking about mermaids, and then I saw that one of the people that works at Spore, you know, I'm not going to say names, uh, she uh, was dressed as a mermaid recently, and I got me thinking, maybe there's more to this mermaid stuff than I thought, you know? I hadn't considered it, but maybe, maybe there is. All right, um, do homework. I'm feeling so motivated to do so many things. You know, I'm just doing all the homework. Oh, hey, what's up? There you are. Can we, can we do homework together? Like, you know? Yeah, she's just like, hey, what's up? I mean, green hair chick. You seem kind of cool. And uh, you seem to be everywhere I am. It's starting to make me wonder. Maybe this is the part where I fall in love with somebody at college. Welcome. And then we become like BFFs forever. And you know, we live happily ever after. Kind of like Jeff Bezos and his wife. They met at Princeton. Except she ended up divorcing him and taking a bunch of his money. Although to be fair, she also was like involved heavily in the early phases of the business. I mean, she deserved a cut. You know, I'm not going to say that she didn't deserve a cut. All right, I'm a reasonable person. Um, so yeah, that's the thing that happened. All right, cool. She's like, oh, I gotta go to the bathroom. Been there. Understand that. All right, we can stay up late and do our work today because it's it's a we got an easy morning, an easy morning. I believe. I'm gonna knock out all this homework. So much of this homework is getting knocked out. Love it. Let's go. All right, now go home and sleep. I feel like we're, we're crushing it this semester. I, if I don't see good grades this semester, I might just give up on this. I might be just completely able to handle it. Because honestly, like, it's getting kind of to the point where you're like, all right, dude, I don't know what else you want from me. I mean, I've tried so hard to make my character a successful character. I've tried to do all my work on time. I'm doing better this, this term than ever before. Every single term... You know, I've, I've tried to step up my game because at first it was going so easy and then it, it stopped going so easy. So now I'm like, all right, I got to do more stuff. You know, I got to work harder. I got to figure out what it is that I'm not doing and start doing that. So maybe, you know, maybe I've got the code. Maybe I figured this out. We'll see. I don't know. We'll find out. Um, there's stanky food, but that's okay. We've already figured out we don't need food in the morning. You're not going to eat the stanky food, okay? Stop trying to eat stanky food. Goodness, my man. All right. Okay. Now. We're gonna edit that term paper. We're gonna work on it a little bit this morning. You know, we're gonna, we're gonna get ourselves, we're gonna do some editing on the term paper, get another draft going. Cause that's, that's key as well. I think to getting your skills up and getting your score up, you gotta do a little bit of that term paper, keep it going. I think that's a plan. And then maybe we'll do a little bit of fun times before we go. Before we go to class. Let's see. Um, 
Oh, and the other thing we want to do is, uh, let's take a look at our pay situation. What's our... Email professors about progress. Yeah, that's another thing you should do. Email your professors about your progress. Doing quite well. Okay, all right, see, they're, they're telling me good things. They're telling me good things. Stay, you're doing fine, you're doing quite well. Okay, so that's positive. Y'all seen it, there's proof, okay? There's proof. There's proof that I'm doing it well. All right, let's have some fun. Play some video games. That's technically doing work for school because I have a video game class right now. Esports, baby, so, you know, we're gonna be responsible. Yeah, I'm gamers. So gamers. All right, you can start. Go to class and get those free magic food points that you somehow get every single time you go to class. All right. It's a good plan. I like where we're at. Okay. Ready for class? Look at me. Ready, early, good to go, being responsible. I feel fine. I think this is it. I think we're going to figure this out. I think we got this under control. Let's see how it goes. All right. Okay. In class. All right, we got four days left. That means should be finishing up on Tuesday, which makes sense because that's the final exam. No, maybe Monday then. That's the final exam for this class. This, today would be day four, three, two, one. Yeah, that sounds about right. So, okay. Coming out of class, did my homework, feeling pretty good. All right, see, I'm getting more positive messages now about my classes so that's good i think that's a good sign I'm gonna go back to the comment. i still don't understand why they treat this as travel i really wish they would just treat this as like part of the same zone it's like weird because if i'm in this zone and then i run to class i can run right back i can even run to my house but like if i i have to warp to this place it's weird i don't i don't fully understand some of the things in this game but that's okay all right so i haven't done that homework from the course that i just left which is fine we'll we'll do it right now we're just going to be super duper responsible do all the homework oh you know what actually hang on let's do it together because i think that's better i think you know when you do your homework with other people you learn more okay so yeah you can sit here and tell other people hey come on hang out let's do homework together Good environment giving you bonus points to your learning and stuff. That's facts right there. That's science. You know, if you're in a good environment, you're more likely to learn stuff. Yeah. Hey, people. How's it going? Yeah, we're doing, we're doing homework. We're being responsible. And uh, Kelvin's, Kelvin's got a cowboy hat. He thought that was a good idea. Cowboy hat and a bow tie. Don't know if anyone's got the heart to tell them the truth, but hey, you know, that's how it goes. Um, do you want to hang out tonight? Um, nah. I don't. <laughs> Sorry. My man just got up and moved his homework. She's like, oh, I left my homework on the floor. Don't worry about it. No problem. We got this. All right. I like how it's going. I like how it's going. Confident. Feeling good. Got the energy. Doing all that homework. Being extra responsible. I'm almost enjoying myself. Let's see. All right, then let's go get free food because, you know, free food is free. So it's the best kind of food. Although we should probably do our like little joke routine here. Keep practicing that set, you know? All right, all the homework is done. Tell some jokes, have some fun. Yeah, boost that fun score, get that comedy skill up. It's good for you. Yeah, tell some uh, fancy jokes, you know? Those are more fun. All right. well, I don't know what some of these things are, right? Let's, check. Let's eat a salad. My man's too chunky. He needs to eat something. All right. My man needs to start going on a diet, eating some healthier food. I, I feel like it's time that you start eating some salads. I don't personally like to eat what my food eats, but, you know, he needs it. My man's too chunky. So give him some salad. Get him healthy. 
Talent showcase, Door embarrass bullet. ourselves. That does sound. You know. All right. Okay. All right. You know what? I accept. Let's go have some fun. I've done all my homework. I've written drafts of my term papers. I I deserve to have a little bit of fun. It's a Friday night. I think that's reasonable. I was just eating a salad. Whoa, this place is pretty dope. Look at this place. Jeez, big swimming pool. Yeah, let's go swimming. So, let's go. Everybody in the pool, let's go. Woo! Yeah, big man in the swimming pool. Yeah, let's uh splash people. That's fun. Haha, ha. ha, -ha. Yes, we swim. Swim over here. Get some exercise. It's good for you. And then go all the way over here. Because you need to. You're fat. Let's go. Yeah. I like this. This is a good pool for swimming. You know, just boom, 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 boom. And then over here. Boom, 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 boom. Aha. Uh -huh. We're there. Yeah, we're having a good time. All right, we're going to need some food. Let's, uh, let's... Oh, it's an open mic thing? Okay, that's kind of cool. Order food. Um... Let's order, Mama like, jerks. what's something that I can have that's not terrible Since for me here? You know, like, just, Mama um, pita and hummus tapas, meat and cheese Maybe. platter, Oop french fries. Yeah, meat and cheese platter seems reasonable. Yeah. Give me some food. Get in my belly. Yeah, that'll, that'll be good. Just a little bit of snack attack, meat and cheese platter. Other people can get in on that, too. I don't mind. I'm a reasonable person. Yeah, we're just talking to people, eating some snacks. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, we can sing. Can we get our sing on? That could be fun. My dad's already got her dance on. She's having a good time. Maybe I'll uh, just dance, you know? As soon as I uh, finish this meat and cheese platter. Yeah, get my dance on. Boom. Uh-huh. That's what I need right there. A little bit of my dance time. It is a little weird that, like, you know, we're just hanging out here. There's this giant swimming pool up on the roof. I don't, you know, I'm not sure that structurally this building was designed for this swimming pool. Like, I, I have my doubts, you know? Because that's a lot of water. That's a lot of weight on the top of a building. I don't know how much you guys are familiar with structural integrity, but it's an important thing to keep in mind. I don't know that this place is up to code. I got my doubts. Here's some swanky bathrooms. Look at this. What is this? Converse with the toilet? Hang on, we need to do that. Let's get over here and talk to this toilet. I want to know what's up with this toilet. How you doing? Whoa, this is like Hal from space. Okay, hang on. Whoa. Use and question mark. I don't know what that's going to do, but let's try it. Let's try using the crazy. Whoa. It just gassed me with like something weird. All right, let's prank that toilet. Prank this toilet get out of here. All right. Yeah, I just bombed that toilet. I'm going to go. All right, talent showcase. Everybody's leaving. Looks like everybody's leaving. Um, okay. Let's go back. Yeah. All right, cool. We, we had a good time. We went and had fun and, you know, did things and prank toilets. These are the things that we do. That's why we're gamers. All right. Um, goodness gracious. Look at all the, the filth around here. Um, let's see what we got. Monte Cristo sandwich. Let's eat that. Grab a serving of that. You should eat something. I mean, my man doesn't really need to eat. I should probably just starve him for a while. But his food bar is pretty low, and he's a hungry boy. So we'll get him some nummies. And then maybe... Hang on. Term papers. Right? This one. Let's work on this. A little bit. Just a little bit. You know? Just a little bit of term papering. You know? Oh, this guy. All right. He stole your spot. No worries. Go ahead and go to sleep. All right. We're doing good. We're doing good. I think we're making a comeback here, my people. I feel like we're, we're on the right track. 
Okay, we're gonna we're gonna breeze through this weekend, knock out our final day. I believe we're gonna get good grades this time. I think we're doing it right. Okay, I think we I think we got this. We're gonna get up here this morning with a bunch of energy and get to work. That term. That's how I see it right now. We got all our homework complete. We just need to work on the term paper, and then I think we're gonna be good. I feel like that's the thing. I think I've neglected some of these minor tasks, like emailing professors and doing like that stuff. And the little homework things seem to make a big difference. So I need to probably just spend more time on these tasks and make sure that I'm diligently doing them, as opposed to slacking off and being a lazy student because i will say i feel like three f's was undeserved i think i did a better job than three f's but at the same time what do i know maybe maybe this is just really really strict maybe college is tough you know um it says this paper's looking good it won't improve much more okay you know what i think then we're gonna submit this term paper whoa wait submit submit not a yeah we don't want to submit the uh which one am I working on? Make the escape. Okay. Submit the paper for make the escape. Okay. We're gonna submit that one. I think that's good. That one is, that one, they just gave me that message of like, hey, there's nothing better you can do about this. It's pretty much done. So let's do this one for Blick Block. Let's get this one up and running. I, I will pass this semester, I swear it. If I am, if I am somehow unable to pass this semester, I'm gonna lose my brain. I'm gonna uninstall straight up and we'll just go back to doing like Q&A streams and other stuff. Cause I, I'm gonna be too angry to continue playing this game. Cause like I have made it my goal to do a good job. I cannot, I cannot accept failure again. Okay, I will not. Unacceptable failure. Will not. All right, will not. Um. How you doing? Let's talk about cooking. How you doing? Do you like cooking? Do you cook things? She's like, no, I don't cook. I'm out. <laughs> Fine, be that way. All right. Yeah, this is this is hardcore university life. Okay, I'm just trying really, really hard. I'm being the try hard student that makes himself suffer instead of having a good time. I mean, I was partying a lot. I was accepting a lot of invitations to do a lot of crazy things. So maybe, you know, maybe it's my fault. So... All right, submit your term paper. Let's go. All right, we've submitted term papers. Okay, perfect. All our homework is done. I can't see this getting better. I really can't. I think this is like the best case scenario. Um, we'll find out, you know, we'll find out if, if, if this works. I want to believe that this is gonna work. I wanna believe that I'm gonna get a good grade this semester and you know not be kicked out on the street because man it was rough last time they kicked me out on the street man sent me home to my parents big disappointment and i don't want that i don't want that for my life okay i i, I believe i can do better i think that's half the battle is believing you know so yeah i think we're doing good we got anything else we could be doing this weekend i mean I could study for things. I could like go be responsible and study. That's that's boring, but it's something I could do. Um, okay. Yeah, you know what? Scavenge for parts. Always scavenge for parts. My man's good at repairing stuff, so. So yeah. Oh man, she's stanky. She got the stank, look. She got that green stank with that green hair. Gross. <laughs> Fix it, fix it, fix it, because you're good at fixing things. And then throw stuff away. And then get and then get cleaned up. Yeah, you get that plumbing upgrade part, then you can start upgrading things with cool stuff. Uh do I wanna hang tonight? Um at the nightclub. Man, I'm good. I'm gonna be responsible. So. Sorry, my dear. Not every night can be a night out on the town for fun and, and stuff. Okay. Oh, and now she wants to go to Romance Festival? Listen, listen, I got to draw a line somewhere, okay? I don't think it's appropriate. 
no thanks. Thank you for the offer, but no thank you. Alright, um, let's study. Let's study for the test. You know? All these stanky people that don't seem to want to shower. Yep, we're being responsible. That's all. We're just going to be the most responsible people that were ever responsible. I believe. Studying. Oh, you eating the stanky food. Oh. No bueno, dude. You don't want to be eating stanky food. That's not good for you, man. I need to get a food. I'm getting hungry. I had a pretty decent little lunch, but I haven't eaten anything since. Definitely tomorrow could be a good hangout day. We're I think we've done so much work for, for, for school. Like, we've literally sat inside all day Saturday and just done work. So, I feel like it doesn't get much better than this. Um, these people kind of stressing my boy out. I think we're going to, yeah, we're going to call this a session. I feel like we're ready. Let's try this again. You know, I think we're going to be good. I feel positive. I feel better about this situation. Go push this thing. What is, what is this little robot thing? What happens if I just take it? Oh, cool. Chops. Makes a little blah, 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 blah. Stranger danger, it says. Haha, <laughs> that's good. Alright, um... Cool. Yeah. Um, now, I do believe I had a student loan before. I don't know whatever happened to that. I was gonna go like, oh wait, make loan payment. Yeah. Um, okay. Let's, let's, let's pay 446. Let's pay like a bunch of that. Okay. Because we can't, you know? Um, all right. I think we're, I think we're in a good spot. I think we're going to call it a night, my people. Um, that's most of that first term. Let's take a, take a look here. So we have, yeah, we'll, we'll finish this term next week, Monday, it looks like. And then we'll see how that goes. Hopefully... Hopefully this is the time that we get it right. I feel like it is. I feel like we're doing it right. I hope. So we'll see. Anyway, thanks for hanging out and thanks for watching. And I will see you next week, my people. Have a good one.